What's going on gardeners? On today's two minute garden tip, I'm going to show you how to cure powdery mildew on your cucurbit plants with a completely natural remedy. Here you can see powdery mildew disease forming on this leaf. All of these white spots right here that you can see, that is all a disease called powdery mildew. And if left untreated, it could prove fatal for the plant. Cucurbit plants like zucchini, squash, pumpkins, gourds, melons, and cucumbers are extremely susceptible to a disease called powdery mildew. Here I have a zucchini squash plant that has survived all the way since April when I originally put it in ground, and I just noticed it's starting to get some powdery mildew on its leaves. While we could break out harsh fungicides in order to combat this problem, we can actually use hydrogen peroxide as a natural remedy that will kill the infection. All you need to make this remedy is a bottle of standard 3% hydrogen peroxide, and you will mix that in water at a rate of 12 tablespoons per gallon. That solution will be powerful enough to kill the powdery mildew. Now it's very important that you purchase 3% hydrogen peroxide to make the solution. If you use a stronger concentration or a weaker concentration, you will need to scale the math accordingly. Now right here, I have a water bottle that is full of 24 ounces of water. So I am going to maintain that same 12 tablespoons per gallon concentration, which is going to be 2.25 tablespoons of the 3% hydrogen peroxide mixed into 24 ounces of water. That is the same ratio, so make sure you do the proper math. Now that our peroxide solution is mixed, we must liberally coat all of the leaves of the infected plant with the spray. Be sure to coat every leaf on the plant and not just the leaves that you see covered by the powdery mildew. You can clearly see the infection is spreading onto other leaves, so every leaf is probably infected to some degree. Be sure to coat the undersides of the leaves too because the disease tends to be even more severe under the leaves because the UV rays of the sun can't reach underneath the leaves to sterilize the surface. If you have a pump sprayer or a ULV fogger machine, that will work even better since you can spray the plants more quickly and efficiently. Be sure to spray your plants at sunset so the solution can sit on the leaves overnight without being burned off by the sun. Be sure to follow up with another spray the very next night and as needed until the infection is gone. Here you can see the same leaf that once had a severe powdery mildew infection. The powdery mildew is almost gone. There's still a little bit more remaining so we'll follow up with the third treatment and that should take care of the rest. While the spray is effective at killing disease, it's even more effective as a preventative spray. If you're growing disease prone plants like tomatoes, squash, and cucumbers, it's a really great spray to spray once a week in your garden to ensure that these diseases never take hold in the first place. And that's today's two minute garden tip. If you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing and hitting the bell to receive new video notifications and check out our Amazon storefront and spread shop in the video description for a list of the gardening products I use and awesome custom designed apparel and other gear. Your support is greatly appreciated.